In this video, we're going to talk about everything you need to know to ace your machine learning coding interviews. My name is Nema, and I'm a product manager and former mobile and machine learning engineer at a big tech company. In a software engineering interview, questions typically focus on data structures and algorithms in a live coding format. In an ML coding interview, the coding prompt generally appears in three unique ways. Number one, writing a common algorithm from scratch. Number two, building an end-to-end -end solution with sample data. Or number three, performing a common machine learning operation. By the way, if you're enjoying this video, be sure to check out Exponent's complete machine learning interview course, featuring hours of ML mock interviews, real-world coding practice, and machine learning system design deep dives. Start for free on tryexponent.com. Number one, write a common algorithm from scratch. First, you might be asked to build an algorithm like k-means or k-nearest neighbors from scratch. You'll need to implement the algorithm using NumPy, remember basic algorithms, and code them from scratch, typically using dummy data. These questions are similar for some data science positions. In data science interviews, you might code linear or logistic regressions from scratch using NumPy and linear algebra, or using scikit-learn. Number two, provide an end-to-end -end solution given some data. Next, you might be asked to write a complete solution with some sample data. You're expected to transform data, choose models and metrics, show hyperparameter tuning, and explain how to search the hyperparameter space, such as using random search versus grid search. You'll also typically visualize the data. For example, in a classification problem with imbalanced labels, you discuss this observation and explain how it affects your choice of metrics, sampling, and loss functions. You might also need to perform exploratory data analysis using matplotlib and Jupyter notebooks. Number three, perform a common ML operation. Finally, you might be asked to perform operations like 2D convolution, self-attention, or batch normalization. These test your knowledge of these operations and your ability to perform them clearly in NumPy. They might also be framed as common coding questions on 2D matrix manipulations. Next, let's talk about some common machine learning coding questions. By the way, Almost all ML coding interviews are conducted in Python, so being well-versed in Python is very important. Here are some questions you can expect. Given a table of data with features such as user time on app or number of interactions, create an ML solutions to predict the likelihood of app deletion. Implement the k-nearest neighbor algorithm. Implement a 2D convolutional filter. Implement the k-means algorithm. Given some text data and labels on whether it is harmful, create an ML solution that predicts harmful text. As you answer, interviewers are listening to how well you understand and solve the given problem, understand the chosen ML framework, implement organized and accurate code, communicate your logic, and display comfort and skill with ML algorithms. To prepare for these interviews, brush up on fundamentals in your ML framework of choice. Most ML startups and large companies use Python and PyTorch. After reviewing the fundamentals, practice implementing common algorithms like logistic regression and k-means under a time limit. Also, spend some time with NumPy arrays. And that's it. Thanks for watching. We hope this advice can help you ace your upcoming machine learning coding interviews. Be sure to check out Exponent's machine learning interview prep course in the description below, and we'll see you in a future video.